Hey, what's going on? Let's go over the news for EQ Worlds this week. We got a little bit to talk about, not too much, so let's get into it. All right, first up, there was a news post. Now, I already covered the not a mod class stuff yesterday, but I thought I'd leave the other stuff for the actual news video I do every Thursday. So we have Year of the Wood Dragon. Interesting. So it's Year of the Dragon, but I think they're adding they're adding the wood part there creatively. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that's the case. And there will be a Wood Dragon set later on in this video. So uh, new rewards, Treasure Horde of the new Yokai Dragon Gear, a class update for not a mod, and Dragon Slayer General Rebalance. So they use the word rebalance there. I wonder what's changing with that. Um, still, it always, it always, I always find it funny that Dragon Slayer General and the other Dragon Slayer class in the game are not the best choices for slaying dragons. That will always baffle me why they have a class specifically named Dragon Slayer and it's not the best choice. Anyway, uh, holiday events in the Ground Hork, uh, Yokai New Year, Here's Heart Day and carnival return so all the seasonals for all of these are coming back i have some cool hero heart day uh seasonals uh along with carnival uh, and yokai I, I mean they all got some decent ones i might make a video going over the best seasonal items for these on the channel no promises but i might if i get around to it uh, upgrade bonus find an all new upgrade bonus set so there'll be a new set there based on year of the dragon as well so interested to see what that is i actually don't know off the top of my head maybe someone in the comment section has a better idea for what that would be and then some boosts and stuff as well the non mod rework that i made a video on yesterday if you'd like to see that uh there is a rare treasure hunt going on as well right now that you can get for these weapons right here uh they're pretty simple to get i'll probably make a short on this uh i probably should have already but my bad but uh yeah uh so check that out if you're interested in those so sorry off this week we got year of the dragon stuff from furrow of uh, the wood dragon it seems is what they're going for in eq worlds use a fire ability against them might be super effective all right so yeah a really cool spear like the the wood with the leaves or whatever those are on there the flowers uh yeah so yeah really cool design actually really like this and yeah a little <laughs> a lot of, a lot of forehead on this little guy down here too so yeah really neat we got to look at the male version of the yokai new year set that lay was making as well so this is a color custom except for the uh, gold wall, all the well, you can see what changes with the color. I don't have to, okay. Also, an update on this set from Lay as well. Uh, so you got more shaded finished up version of that, should be coming out very soon into the game. Love the the black blades with the gold accents, very nice. Also, some sad news relating to the set. Well, sad if you wanted to get it anytime soon, uh, but you know, it's still coming to the game, so better than not releasing. <coughs> Most of Guitaro's old stuff, please. Uh, Anyway, uh, so this is uh, the street style it is coming out in August. So we have to wait until summer for that to come out uh, for the left one there. But we'll have the right one right away. So yeah, I guess uh, at least it's coming out. While we're on the topic of things not coming out anytime soon, uh, this set from Shadow Slayer is not coming out uh, maybe next year. This was actually one of the cooler uh, designs I've seen for anything Nolgatha related or um, like nation related recently. So yeah, I was kind of looking forward to it. And I think the weapon, if, if uh shadow slayer was doing weapon designs for this, I think they'd turn out very well as, as well. So yeah, maybe we'll see this next year, but it kind of disappointing. It didn't get to be released this year. Really, really unique set from Australia. Uh, I, I never know how to say his name. I'm sorry. But uh, so yeah, the, whew, this looks very, uh, like visually stunning like it's it's got a lot of good elements going on I'll, like the i like the sharp hood look with the gold the metal and the fabric combined very nice very nice so and it's got clickable wings as well yeah so good stuff really cooking here oh this one was really cute from moira this actually looks like something they should have for halloween i always think like the costumes and stuff like this for halloween would be really nice in aq uh, like having like ones that actually look like silly Halloween costumes, stuff like that, like a frog zard outfit. So yeah, really cool. It's really cool. I didn't expect to see a uh, set like this this week. So I guess with Easter coming up, a Fae Bunny Girl outfit would be very suited to the event. It'd be cool if they made it seasonal and like a kind of you know, like a medium and long farm uh, for it. Maybe with like some darkened receipts or something uh, like that. Would be nice, and people probably hate that I'm suggesting that, and they just want to buy phrases. But I think uh, I think having some more like cool gear to farm would be nice, and maybe they could make like a 
semi-color custom version and put in the shop as well like a rare one do the twofer if they want to release it that'd be nice i'm just coming up with ideas here but anyway just yeah really cool set from aze there or a's anyway but yeah really nice hope it gets added to the game in some form or fashion some cute casual gear here from Sefi. uh yeah so really like the tree and all that and the little moglin <laughs> yeah twilly very happy and sipping on his drink and stuff so yeah i think it's kind of like a, a bit of a k-pop theme with the uh, clothing and stuff so yeah pretty nice stuff there from Sefi. all right last one for today we'll end on some heat this dragon looks very nice uh combined effort from krulong making i think this will be like a boss mob or something in the map and then a cape version from a ranks here uh so yeah so two two for one there on that one very good actually but it, it has to be new yeah it's separate art right it'd have to be remade for the actual cape but yeah so really good i they actually match up very well like a ranks did a very good job matching the art it yeah that's great and apparently it's cc as well hope we have a cc version a rank says yeah so this might be a very sick cape actually uh so i imagine if this was like if this was red this i think the color combo would look better with the green and red so if you could have like a red one that'd be, that'd be really cool huge thanks to all the channel members for supporting the channel making videos like these possible really appreciate all the support from all of the channel members yeah, big thanks to them. And thanks for watching this video. Leave a like on it if you liked it. Subscribe to the channel if you guys aren't already. And check out the video I made on the, the new class tomorrow. Well, it's basically a new class that completely reworked uh, the not a mod class. I'll have a video on that this weekend probably uh, because I, I have the class and it's getting updated tomorrow. So we'll be checking out the stream tomorrow as well when we do the streaming stuff as well like normal. And the Year of the Dragon's looking good. So the event tomorrow should be pretty sweet. So I'll see you then. And uh, thanks for tuning in. Peace.